What's up, Poltergeist and Ghouls? I am Ghost Boy Colby. I'm back here in Skyrim, fucking finally. Um, so I took that long ass, I guess, hiatus from making videos, and now I need to get the pattern back up and going. Uh, last video I uploaded was Bioshock, so now I'm back here in Skyrim. And then after that, uh, I already have some Bioshock videos ready, so. What I'll need to do is get some, uh, Final Fantasy and Skyrim videos going. Uh, cause I think once I do that I should be able to upload like six videos within the near future. So hopefully I can get that done, but I think if I remember correctly the last thing I wanted to do in Skyrim was try and figure out how I can get a house. And I think what that entailed was me and, uh, Lydia going and fulfilling some contracts um, I think that's what it was because I know I didn't want to go and uh, take care of that I thing with the main story <laughs> uh, I forget what buttons do what is it I guess that wasn't it hold on oh yeah yeah, yeah. the d-pad no? Wait. Oh, B. Okay. Yeah, I completely forgot the <laughs> controls for this game. But, map. Uh, is there any way I can check the map for contracts or anything? Doesn't look like it. Hmm. Journal. I, I don't know. I, I don't know how... I thought there was something where I could do, like, um... Basically, bounties. Where I, like, hunt... I don't know if it's animals or people or something, but... I thought there was a way I could get money. Um... I'll figure it out. Maybe... Oh, hold on. Let's talk to Lydia. I've got your back. Um, damn it. All right, what is it? What do you need? Uh oh. Anything else? No, I just need. Hmm. Honestly, I should probably look this shit up so I'm not just stumbling around blindly, but. I don't know, I kind of prefer the. Stumbling around blindly way in this game because that way I'll actually remember it once I do figure it out You know because if I just look it up, it's not very likely that I'll actually remember it What is this place? I guess we're going in Go play I was talking to my cat What? Oh, we've been here. And I think I noped out of it originally. I don't really want to steal anything. I want to see what's going on here. Okay, so we got two two women fighting. You think you stand a chance? This should be good. I don't know what I should do. But hey, you. What are they fighting about? Uh, okay, so I guess I have nothing to say about the fight. Um, I don't know if there's the threat of a dragon tech. I wouldn't think so, because we killed the damn dragon. Who are the companions? You're big a bunch of layabouts and useless whiners who used to know how to fight. But he thinks everything used to be better. I, for one, would trust any companion with my life. Okay, why did you join well, the companions? Companion oh, you didn't. He took me in when I was having a tough time and... Well, I hope. Uh-huh. Okay. Farewell, sir. Forbidden, but even so, it's not true. So that's What's going on here? I'd be dead if not for Vignar. Okay. He <laughs> just came up in my face, started talking to me. I was, I'm like, I was done with you, dude. 
If you um, wish to your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Oh. I've got a bad grip on my shield. Would you take a look at it? Hey you. Iskramor himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. Can I join the companions? We don't just take in any milk drinker who stumbles in. Talk to Codlack if you think you have what it takes to be a companion. All right, where's Codlack? Mm -hmm. Speak with the leader of the companions. That's secure. I, I think that's how you pronounce it. Need something? Yeah, I do. Where's your leader? Take me to your leader. What? Oh. Is he down here? He, she, I don't know. Are they down here? Oh, I'm just a servant, dear. You want to talk to one of the companions, I'm sure. Yes, I do. Where are they? What do you need? I need... What? What's his name? Cadlock? I already forgot. Codlick? Something. Fuck off. But well, to be fair, I am in your living quarters, but I need what to find hell? somebody. Watch what you're doing. Get out of my way. Uh. I see everything, hear everything, and know everything. Yeah, that's what every boomer says. Or thinks, at least. Nobody in here? Hmm. What? And get out of the way, Lydia! Move! Fuck. But I still hear the call of the blood. We all. Okay, Vilkis. There's Codlack! Okay, that's who I need to talk to. White man, I see. But I don't know if the rest will go along quite so easily. Leave that to me. Why are you looking at me but still talking to each other? Greetings, outsider. If you have some business here, speak it. I would like to join the companions. Here, let me have a look at you. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Well, I did kill a dragon, You're so... You're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in your Vasker for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. But perhaps... Oh, I do got heartburn. I've never even heard of this Wait. outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. Okay. What matters is their heart. Uh, like I said, I got hype heartburn. Of course. How are you in I almost said hype burn. Uh, I can handle myself. That may be so. This is Vilkas. He will test your arm. Well, Vilkus, I I largely use team. magic. I. <laughs> Did he just say I? <laughs> Not here. Out in the yard. Come on. Okay. Is this a way I can get money? I just want a house, dude. <laughs> oh, got more to say. That's all I want. I didn't. S wait. Okay. I didn't say anything to you. I'm just gonna start ignoring NPCs because it's like they always want to say something. And like for no. Wait. Did he leave or did he not? Where'd he go? I'm confused. Do I go here? Huh? Oh, training dummies. Okay. The old man said to have a look at you. So, let's do this. Yeah, let's Just do it. have a few swings at me so I can see your Swings? Form. I don't, don't use swords. I can take it. Whoa! Whoa! Ah! Okay, I need to do something about this sensitivity. I think I have it way too high or something. 
Gameplay. We don't do battle with magic around here. Now come I, at me. But I use magic, dude. Okay, um... Fine, let's go with... I guess the steel sword does more damage. Whoa, Lydia, what are you doing? Not that. Next time won't be so easy. You might just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorlin to have it sharpened. And be oh, careful. so he's just giving me a sword. Probably worth more than you are. Or is this like some sort of quest where I have to take it, sharpen it, then give it back to him? I don't know, dude. So I guess they just ignored the fact that Lydia's here. Like, as far as they're concerned, I'm the only person they care about. And if I happen to have a partner, then so be it. But the partner isn't necessarily, uh... Whatever they're called. I don't know how to pronounce these, like, Nordic or whatever type words. Who are you? I hear you have spirit. Okay. This is good. You may yet join our numbers. Right. I'm looking for... Wait. I should probably... Yes, sir. Uh, here we go. Wait. Yeah, I should probably just follow the fucking arrow, huh? <laughs> Wait. Oh. Well, I thought I already came across A.R. Lund or whoever it was. Are they not? I guess they're obviously not inside. Let's go find them. Oops. I forget if there's a run button or if this is like my max speed. I guess it is. I don't know. Uh, I guess I go this way, huh? Yep, that adds up. See, so it should be right over there. Wait, I don't think this is right. Is it? So this goes out of White Run. Let me check the map. Um. Journal. Quests. See, so that's the one I want set. I don't want that one. So where... Okay. Yerland. Well, that's all the way up by Dragon's Reach. I might as well just go to fucking Dragon's Reach. What is it? Okay. Um. Let's keep a moving. Is there like another exit out of White Run? Or is it just showing me that because that's the way to go as the crow flies? Because if it's just as the crow flies, then I can't actually get out of this city that way. I don't like when they do that. Yeah, I think it's just as the crow flies. Right, because I can't, like, jump over the wall. That's kind of frustrating. Well, either way, I need to leave White Run, so I guess I just need to go down to the exit. Woo! Ow. Fall damage. It wasn't that much, but ow. Okay. I guess I keep wasting time. Don't I? <laughs> I don't even know what to talk about it because I mean all we're doing is just trying to get out of White Run, so we can go find Erland and have him uh, 
Sharpen the sword. Can I get out this way? No, I can't. I just keep seeing the arrow move and I'm like, uh, that makes me feel like I'm going the wrong way. But actually I'm not because there's only one fucking way out of White Run, and it's this way. So yeah. Ugh. Wait. Then I took an arrow in the knee. The famous line. Oh my god. <laughs> that made my day. Okay. Um, and a lot of people don't know this but a lot of people do know this so i'm just gonna say it just in case uh i'm pretty sure Ar took an arrow in the knee is a saying that means he got married so he used to be an adventurer but then he got married uh it's not like he literally got shot in the knee although he may have i don't know but i would figure if he had he wouldn't be standing on both knees or on both legs just fine So yeah, I didn't think I would just casually come across somebody saying the famous line. Oh, uh, that, that just made the entire episode. In fact, that's going to go in the title. I don't know if anything else interesting will happen in the video, but you know, at least we have that to fall back on. Do I have to, do I have to go back into Whiterun? I'm confused. There's, why was that so hard for me to find? Whatever. You know what? Honestly, I'm going to edit that shit. After the... <laughs> after the part where we hear the famous line, I'm just going to edit it. Because normally I don't like to edit, but that was pointless. What brings you here? Erland Greymane. I'm guessing you're the newcomer. Um, does Vukas always send newcomers on errands? Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. And don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the Companions. Hmm. Someone has to well, be in charge, though. I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Yzgrimor. Kodlak is the harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own. Every woman, her own. I see. Well, are you a Not companion? Not actually a companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly, and I'm honored to serve them. My name is Yorlin Greymane. Yorlin. I work the Skyforge. Yorlin. Best steel in all of Skyforge. I keep pronouncing it all wrong. All of Tamriel. I have a favor to ask. Okay, so from I've one quest to another. I've been working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aella for me. Uh... Well, there is a good point there. Didn't you just tell me not to be a servant? This isn't a command. Just decency. Help out an old mm. blacksmith. I've got to get back to my work. Ah, fine. Bring Aella her shield. Where's Aella? Please don't tell me it changed my quest again. Okay, it didn't. It has it where it needs to be. Um, let's get down. I guess when I do stuff like that, Lydia can't keep up with me. Maybe she doesn't know how. Oh, there we go. That must have been what happened before. When I was running around aimlessly, Outside of White Run, even though my quest was in White Run, um, I did some maneuvering like that, and Lydia couldn't keep up with me, and I lost her, and I was like, "Whoa, where the hell did she just disappear?" So yeah, that's that's what happened with that. But man, I just want some goddamn money. Oh. I just want a house. I swear. <laughs> All right. Loading. I 
There we go. You were just out there. Where's Ayla? She's right around this corner. If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Well, hold on, I gotta give Eastamore you a shield. Himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. Okay. <laughs> ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Are you new here? I told you. Ye this is the whelp that Bilk is. Yeah. That's ah, all you yes. have to say about that? I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkas catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkas in a real fight? Uh... I don't care for boasting. Ah, a man of action. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did Hello. you call me? Of course we did, Icebrain. Hey. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. Whelps. Oh, hello. I'm Farkas. Come, follow me. You sound so pleased to meet what me. Skior and Ayala like to tease me, but they're good people. They challenge us mm -hmm. to be our best. Okay, so nice just to have a, a new face around. It gets pretty basic warrior mentality. This can be a rough throughout life. the collective. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Uh -huh. Double will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. But let let me in. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've got trouble right here in White Run Hold. Nothing we can't handle. You know I like hammering. What kind of trouble should I expect? Vampires. I can take oh every my. precaution. One bite, you could end up as one of them. Uh, I'll take care of it, I guess. Do not spare them your blade. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, kill the leader of the Broken Fang Cave. Man, I just wanted some fucking money for a house, and now I'm going and killing vampires. That's basically the story of Skyrim in a nutshell from what I've heard. Man, I just wanted to blah blah blah. Now I'm blah blah blah. Where am I headed? Around here. Just going straight for the arrow. I think it's around this way. Yes, it is. God might get nervous. Ah, oh, I have to leave White Run. Thinking of settling in. Right. It's a house for sale. Breeze, Breeze home. home. You should talk to the steward up in the keep if you're interested. Well, we'll get there. That's basically what I'm doing all of this for. But. Holy shit. That's a long way to go. Can I just... Damn it. I haven't discovered it yet. Fuck. Well, let's... Hmm. Where have I been? Rorikstead. I have not been to Rorikstead, I mean. I haven't been to Morthal. I haven't been much of anywhere I guess they're all gonna be a far distance from it uh, let's go to the Western Watchtower get us a little bit closer save us some running not much it's hard to talk about anything entertaining in this game because it's just trying to decide what I'm gonna do Oh, <laughs> it looked like the dragon's skeleton was like coming to life. I was like, no fucking way. <laughs> what? You? Who said that? Get him, kill him. 
God might get nervous. Oh, boo hoo. Uh, map. So, okay. Just head towards the arrow now. But yeah, no, I think the the dragon skeleton was like spawning into the world and it like fell down and started jostling around. And I was like, what the hell? Why is it moving? <laughs> I was like, look, dude. I understand Skyrim and all, but I don't want to fight a fucking dragon skeleton. Because for some reason that just seems a lot more dangerous than fighting the actual dragon it came from. Ugh. Ah! Wolves. Wait, where's Lydia? <laughs> I'm apparently stupid. Wait, who did that? Did somebody shoot it? Oh, there's Lydia. I was like, you've abandoned me. I'm right behind you. Uh. Okay. Well, you know, keep up. <laughs> I guess she was protecting me from the wolves. In which case, thank you, but like, it scared me because I thought she abandoned me. And then one of the wolves dies and I'm like, whoa, I didn't do that. <laughs> I guess I just need to trust Lydia, huh? But I don't wanna, <laughs> I don't, I don't wanna trust anybody. <laughs> Friggin' finished him. Alright, considering we're basically taking the most direct path, I think we're pretty much gonna be there in no time. I mean, we might have to keep killing the wolves along the way in self-defense, but I think we should get there pretty soon. In fact, I... Okay, Broken Faith Fang Cave discovered. Alright, Lydia, you ready to go... Murder some vampires? Well, is it really murder? I don't know. Oh, we're going in. I think she started to say something, but she stopped. She got cut off. Okay. This looks spooky. Mm. Fuck. Damn it, Lydia. Skeleton. Can Lydia die? I hope the fuck not. I wasn't even that close to dying. What the fuck? Oh, I hate that shit. I was watching my health bar. I was not that close. You fucking piece of shit. Fuck it. If they're using magic, let's use magic. Alright, let's try fire. And see if that's any more effective. So let's like... Aha, I think she's weak to fire. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I keep lighting her on fire. Fuck! Sorry, Lydia. I can't really 
hit anything <laughs> that I want to hit. All right, let's take the gold. Vampire dust, value 25, that's not bad. Vampire armor, I mean, it looks pretty cool, but, well, I'll sell it. Uh, vampire boots, uh, I guess. I'm just gonna sell everything, cause like I have no use for it. Alright, sorry I let you take so much damage and sorry I kept uh, hitting you with my uh, fire. I need to get better about that, cause if I'm just, <laughs> I'm gonna keep killing L Lydia every time. But yeah, I should have just used fire from the beginning. I should have figured, you know, if they're like undead type enemies, they're going to be more susceptible to that. I don't know why I used the word susceptible. Oh, I guess these are like the coffins that the skeletons came out of. Or not coffins, but more like, um, I guess they're more like, hmm, I don't know. Oh, this is the master vampire. Shit, dude. <laughs> Not the most exciting battle, but hey, it's working. Fuck yeah, Lydia. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know what? It worked. Ooh, amethyst. Cool. Vampire dust. Vampire armor. Vampire boots. And iron sword. I'm gonna sell that. Ooh, potions. <clears throat> Feels like my voice keeps giving out. Let's see. Alchemy lab. How the fuck do I... I don't know how to use this. Okay. Ingredients. Uh, I don't, I would have no idea where to start. I don't know what makes what. It's cool though. <laughs> Alright. Bandit. I mean, Lydia can take that stuff, so I guess, I guess I'll take it and then trade it to her. But I don't need that hide and fur stuff. So I'll take the arrows and come here, Lydia. I'm right behind you. Need to trade some things with command. you. So, uh, would it be under weapons? I guess. Oh, whoops. Give. Uh, yeah, just take them all. And then these two. Take them all. And then that's it. I don't want anything from you. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, all right. So yeah, that was definitely not the most exciting <laughs> fight, but hey, it worked. Mm. I don't think I'm gonna read this. Yeah, it's too long. Too long, sorry. I, I'll read all this shit eventually. I think I have the ability to go back and read it, but if you, if you wanna read it for right now, just pause the video at each page. So yeah. Uh, history, where's, okay, Argonian account, book one. La 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 la. God damn, these things are long. Okay. Uh. God damn, I know there's. Okay, dance and fire. That's what I was trying to get to. I understand this is all like world world building and stuff, but. There's so fucking much, dude. And it's like, 
I'm just gonna burn my voice out all in one go <laughs> if I try and read all of this. I don't know what I took, but I guess it don't matter. Oh. I thought I might be able to open the other one. Okay, so there were three books. I looked through all of them. Chest, what's in here? That's worth a lot. I'm just concerned with the amount of uh, gold that it will give me. Amethyst, 11 gold. Uh, if I take another spell tome, does it like increase my... <sighs> Fuck it, I'll take it. If nothing else, I can s sell it. Staff of zombies, holy shit, that's worth a lot. Reanimate a weak dead body to fight for you for 60 seconds. Necromancy? I think yes. All right, uh, search the end table. What's in here? Hmm, nothing. Besides a little bit of gold. What's in here? I'll take that gold. You can keep your other shit. Oh, there's the other book. Wait, didn't I already... Wait, no, I already read that. Dance of Fire Volume 1, Brief, Brief History of the Empire Volume 2. The Dance of Fire Volume... So they have multiple copies of the same book. Okay. Pretty Soul Gem. Black Soul Gem. Common Soul Gem. Steel Sword of Embers. Oh, uh, okay. Illusion increased. What? Just from reading? <laughs> well, technically, I mean, I'm not actually reading it. I'm just flipping through, but... Okay. Keep going. Okay. Um, I guess let's take that... How do I use the arcane enchanter? I don't know. I guess let's... To enchant an item, you must know an enchantment and have a filled soul gem to power the enchantment. Enchantments are learned by disenchanting enchanted items. Oh! These are all enchanted. I see. Join the companions. I did that a while ago, but okay. Wow, I didn't realize. Okay, so I'm not disenchanting the stuff that I have on. Uh, banded iron shield of minor blocking. I don't even use... I don't use shields. But... I will hold on to that sword. So, let's see. Creatures and people up to level 5 flee from combat for 30 seconds. Eh. Yes. When the fear enchantment. And then... Fire damage enchantment. Cool. Uh, I guess I can't enchant that other or disenchant that other one. So let's use that and uh, I guess these things here are the only things I can enchant. Let's enchant this steel sword. Steel s oh, and I need a soul gem, gotcha. Pretty soul gem. Let's do it. Uh, craft. Cool. Cool. Well, I did it. I don't know if that was any good, but I did it. God, the acceleration. 
bloody rags. Why would I want those? Are they an ingredient? I don't know what's an ingredient and what isn't. Did I already search this? No, I did not. Now I have more gold. Embalming tool, leather strips. Man, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> I've taken all I want. Damn, those vampires are tough. I'll tell you what. I'm hauling ass out of here and I'm not looking back. Come on, Lydia. Alright, uh, once I get back to Whiterun, that's probably going to be the end of the episode. Because I don't know how long this video has been. But for me, I, I'm not one of those people that can play Skyrim for hours and hours and hours and hours. I can only handle so much at a time. So, oh, mammoths. Cool. But yeah, I can only handle so much at a time when it comes to Skyrim. More power to you if you can play it all day, but I personally can't. So, yeah. Also, this is a different topic, but like... Uh, seeing the moon so big like that makes me think of a dream I had last night where for some reason the moon just looked insanely huge so yeah that was that was a thing I don't know why <laughs> but it was a thing and in fact that's not even the first time I've had a dream like that like I've had a lot of dreams where it's like the moon for some reason is just way closer to earth than it normally is um, in one of my dreams uh, the moon actually like pulled into earth and like crashed into it so that one was not fun but sometimes the other dreams are just like it's just this weird anomaly where for some reason the moon happens to be closer like a lot closer to earth than it normally is and when I say a lot I mean like it looked as big as that if not maybe a little bigger so yeah I don't know why I have those dreams I don't know what they might mean but that they are what they are a lot of times I don't even remember my dreams so the fact that I remember those is mostly just because it's kind of a re recurring element that stands out it's like why the fuck do I keep dreaming about a big moon well it's not necessarily that the moon's bigger it's just that it's closer to the earth than it normally is so it looks bigger you know but uh i don't know why i didn't just fast travel to white run but maybe it's because i wanted to talk about my dream could be maybe it's just because i like to make things hard on myself but let's stop making things hard on myself and just fucking fast travel wait what can I not fast travel once I'm out here? World map. I'm confused. Okay. That was weird. Uh, so return to Farkas. Let's go... Wait. White run. Stables. No. Let's go to white run. Um, white run central location in Skyrim has made it a trading hub of the entire province. Cool. All right. Well, yeah, I didn't really have a lot of interesting stuff to say in this video. Sorry about that. But uh, I kind of had fun, apart from the frustration of trying to beat that first vampire. I don't know who said that. I think everybody would. Alright, let's go in here. Uh, I'm probably not going to talk to whoever it said to talk to. <laughs> I'll save that for the next episode, but uh, yeah. Oh, wow, well, he's right there, Farkas. Uh, but for now, I think I've had my fill of Skyrim. I might do another episode today, but I actually have another game in mind for today. And it's not any of the games I've played as of yet. 
but considering I already have Bioshock videos ready, I'm probably gonna do... I might do this video, and then the other video, the other game that I have in mind, and then upload a Bioshock video. So basically I'll be adding a video in between the Skyrim and Bioshock videos that would normally take their place in the pattern. You know, of like Bioshock, Skyrim, Bioshock, Final Fantasy, Bioshock, Skyrim, Bioshock, Final Fantasy. I'm just gonna insert, insert a game in between Skyrim and Bioshock. Um, it's not gonna be a very, very long game. It's an indie game, so if that gives you any clues as to what it is, um, it's, it, I'll say this, it's an indie game, an indie horror game, and probably not the one you're thinking of. So that's, those are all the clues I'll give, uh, until then, uh, I'm gonna get off of here, and, uh, all I can say is, uh, until the next video, peace.